We talked about that lady who posted the tribute to her deceased sugar daddy that was... Wasn't exactly a compliment to him, but no, I don't think she wanted it to be. She's referred to him as toxic. Wish she had never met him. We have a couple people on hold that have been in sugar daddy, sugar mama, sugar baby relationships. Uh, Jane Bo will get to in just a second. First, Jimbo on the harmonizer. Hi, Jimbo. Number two, how are you? I'm good. Cool. I'm an old friend of the shows, and we're friends, so glad I'm on the. Wait, so we know you in person? Yes. We, If you were to walk in the room, we'd know exactly who you are, we'd know your name, and we'd say, hey, how's the family? Pretty much. Okay. 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 All right. Oh, Exciting. Boy, I am oh. so are we, curious. Are we allowed to, are we allowed to guess, or, or do you don't want no, us to guess, no, do you? No, you're not allowed to guess. <laughs> okay. No. okay. All right. I'm oh, laughing. Man. I've been laughing at the nice, politically correct answers that... Uh, Hot wings, hot wings and free beer have been given about the, oh, I would not find anything out of that relationship. I would feel so empty. Yeah. I know the wives are listening. So, anyway. Well, that's probably um, true, but it was an... Uh, yeah, that's I mean, not why I say that, though. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, like, my wife doesn't right, care so, what I would do in an imaginary situation if she didn't exist. Yeah, I can't, I can't, I can't disappoint her with the things I say anymore. That doesn't, that doesn't matter. Uh, I just would, I would just feel weird so giving, I think, Jimbo, giving was, money also i'm too cheap to do it what was your sugar daddy <laughs> situation you were in or or sugar baby right. yeah so i've i've had i guess four sugar daddy sugar baby relationships before uh and they've all worked out great and all of the one I mean, each one of them has been multi-year and and i'm still really good friends or, you know still in contact with the three that i don't see now and and it's worked great. Now, I'll give you a couple of reasons why. Okay. Now, wait, were you, are you the daddy or the baby? No, I'm the daddy. Okay, so the you're buy, okay. so you're yeah, yeah. with these, oh, okay. these women and you're buying them things. Okay. Yeah. So, I mean, here's the thing. Those sites, there's, there, it's the full gamut just like regular life. I mean, there's tramps and sluts on there, but then there's also some people that are genuinely just trying to get a leg up and take some pressure off of their bills and sure, all that. No, no pen yeah. intended. Here's, yeah. mm-hmm. here's part of the dynamic that works. When you're divorced and you're in your mid-40s and you've got some money and, you know, you've done all right, every woman that's coming at you has got is divorced and half of them got three or four kids or a couple that they're looking for a new dad for or, you know, people, there a lot of, everybody's after you kind of, you have to question ulterior motives. Okay. The sure. thing that's really cool about the that relationship is that it's really, uh, you know, it's upfront, and you kind of work out, here's how much we'll see each other, and here's what you need help on. You can either take it or not. I mean, things are, it's very honest for the most part. And the ones that aren't, you just sort through those and say, no, that's not for me. And, you know, you got to sort through it and figure out, you know, what works for you and if there's a genuine connection, obviously, if you're a big fat slob and you're trying to go out with a super hot chick, you're going to feel like you're being used. However, you know, it can be a very cool thing where, you know, you're looking at them, the age gap and stuff is big enough to where, you know, they're not looking to try and rope you in as a husband yeah. and you're not trying to take on another spouse or a wife and so it works. I mean, you know, there's G- some, okay. I've Jimbo, are you, had the same experience. Are you in one right now? Yes. What is your sugar baby like? A ten. Yeah. Like right. how, how so old you, is yeah, she? Yeah, and how old yeah, are you? So you said you're yeah. in your you're in your mid forties. Yeah. Uh, twenty four. Okay. She's, she's twenty four. Okay. 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 How much do you pay her on a like? What's the payment schedule like? How much do you pay her, and how often do you pay her? It's actually less now because I helped her with her career, so it's uh, you know. I, Help her introduce her, and there's a lot of that mentoring stuff that goes on. Too. Is she in so radio too? Some people okay, she is. I'm yeah. looking for that. So probably you know, fifteen hundred a month. A is... wife is three times that. Okay, yeah, fifteen hundred okay. a month. Um, it's so, money. So well, what do you guys yeah. do yeah. together yeah, okay, other yeah. than just have sex? I mean, do you do you have a relationship like outside of sex? Yeah, plenty like... of yeah. That's actually. This is two years, three years now, so it's uh, 
actually that part of it is like any other relationship. It kind of has, you know, uh, fizz, not fizzled down, but it's more of a, a pace kind of thing. So I would say but, 10 to 1 time together is just doing but, regular things. Jimbo, to, do you, you love her, but you're not, dance, stuff like that. you love her, but you're not in love with her. Is that true? Yeah, but it's one of those things where you just don't let your mind go there. I mean, it obviously would never work in a totally out front situation. So it just it takes a lot of pressure off, honestly. You know, you're not having to sit there and wonder the whole um, uh, long term of thing of it. Is it uh, like, does it really bum you out at some point? Like at some point it has to be like, well, I graduated college. I'm moving Smell you later. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to do 24 year old things like have fun and phone guys I like and <laughs> pay my own rent. Yeah. yeah because you, yeah, I mean, I mean Jimbo, that's got to be kind of a bummer. Yeah. Jimbo, you're like, you're not a dummy. Yeah, so but listen, it, if you, if the money the goes time, away, she goes away. The first time that, that I went through that with the first one, it was a bummer. But then you just kind of, you learn to, you know, that's the deal. So you either got to suck you're prepared it up for it. And, all right, um, interesting. We got to let Jimbo go because I want to. I, I want to get Janebo as well off the air. Will you tell us who you are and who she is, please? Pretty please. We will not tell a soul. Yeah, yeah. you know yeah. us personally, Greg. You were, or, yeah. Somebody just pick up offline. That's fine. Oh, I'll go okay. pick it up. All right, oh, okay. okay. Steve's okay. gonna Perfect. go pick it All up. Right. Okay, hold on. Okay. I want to know who she is too. I want to yeah, know I, both. We're yeah, gonna know yeah. Both. I mean, yeah. if you said help to we're help with a career, we're I wanna... colleagues. I gotta know. Derp, derp, derp.